Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Louis Iwepo. So in today's video, I'm going to be taking you guys behind the scenes so you guys can see how I get a bride ready. And also in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get rid of flyaways. So if this is what you're interested in, this video is definitely for you and you need to keep watching. So you guys let's dive right into it so first i'm going to get my argan oil you can use any type of oil you want to use but now you're not going to put too much so this is a particular brand i'm using the mamiya argan oil so i'm going to apply small on my palm and then rub it in so i'm going to like apply it directly on the hair and then massage it and make sure it gets to every strand so then after that i'm going to get my tresemme heat control and then spray it all over the hair so then after that i'm going to get the wax stick so this wax stick i'm going to be using now is from hair by any on instagram if you guys are following my channel you know i've done a couple of unboxing and i've used their products here on this channel so i'm just going to like apply it faintly on the front and then get my hand dryer and its tangling brush so i'm going to like run the hand dryer and the brush through it to make sure like i blow dry it properly Sorry guys, I didn't get to introduce the makeup artist I'm working with today. So her name on Instagram is Asa Official. So I like to work with her. She's so sweet. So you guys can go look her up on Instagram and also follow her because she actually did an amazing job on today's bride. So now I'm going to take out some strands for baby hair. If you guys are following my channel, you, you must have seen um, like a very detailed video on how to install frontals and you know you see how I take out the hair and then do all the trimmings for baby hair. So that's what I'm doing basically here in today's video. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever I post a video. So you guys the reason why i did the middle part is to get the baby hair accurately because i wouldn't want one to be higher than the other one so then after that i'm going to get my hot comb from love beauty products i did an unboxing for them sometime and i also use their products so i'm going to leave their instagram in the description below so you guys can go check them out so i'm just going to use the hot comb to like flatten the hair backward so then after that i'm going to get my got to be spray because i like to do this brush thing in front before i now tie it with um, the elastic band so it can actually you know sweep backward so then after that i'm going to like section the hair and do a c curve and then get my wax and get the hot comb and use it to like make everything look all slicky and that's it for this part
So since we're going to be doing a side swoop, I'm going to get my Corella. So the Corella I'll be using today is in size 32. So I'm not going to use any hold spray to do this because if you use a hold spray, it's going to be very difficult when you're trying to comb it out and you might end up pulling the front out. So I just go in and curl inwardly and then allow it to heat. So then after that, I'm going to remove it and then put my use my control pins to hold it down so you guys can see i'm trying to move um what's it called the elastic band so that it won't create a hash line because makeup is going on so we don't want to have like hash line on that part so it's also advisable to tell the makeup artist you're working with to use a brush like a tiny brush on the forehead so it doesn't get to the lace part because you don't want to start having like patches on the lace because everybody wants their job to like appear really good so you just have to tell them because most of these makeup artists they don't know how to like you know do that part so that it will mess your work up because everybody is just trying to make sure their own job is looking all you know fine and beautiful so you just have to tell them how to like you know touch their powder or their brush or their beauty um, blender on that part so just tell them and you're good to go so i'm going to like curl three now and then hold it down so then after that i'm going to do my um bone so i have a video on this type of hair padding i did for this bride i'm going to leave it up here so you guys can go watch it and learn how to do this particular you know bone So now to the most important part where everyone has been waiting for. So I like to use my rat tail comb to like blend everything together. So once I'm done with that, I'm going to get the wax stick and then apply it gently. So I'm not putting too much. So this is how I control all the flyaways. So I just press it in and then so once I'm done, I'm going to use my comb to like match everything together so then after that i'm going to get a hairspray and then spray it underneath so you guys just pay attention so you can really understand how this whole thing is going and i'm so sorry the makeup artist is going you know back and forth we're actually working together so i just decided to film this video for you guys so you can have an idea of how i work on my bride and how i control flyaways So this part now seemed or looks like the most difficult part because a lot of us are trying to get that high part in front and we don't seem to like get it you know right so what i normally do is i get my control pin and then put one first so now as i'm putting it you guys can see i'm not taking it to the extreme i'm just leaving it in the middle then i'm going to get another one and then place it so it can you know 
give it the lift in front so once i'm done with that i'm going to get um a paper and then put underneath after all the spot and then spray so the spray doesn't get to like touch her face
and that's it for today's video i hope it was really insightful and you guys really enjoyed it please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're yet to do that and also don't forget to give this video a very big thumbs up like my other videos watch them share them with your friends and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever i post a video so if there anything you'd want to see here on my channel please don't forget to leave it in the comments below and i promise you guys i'm going to come through so i love you all to the moon i'm back and i'll see you in my next video bye bye